So let's talk about what a DNA testing business actually is and how it works. A DNA testing business is a service-based business. It's a business in which you provide people and organizations DNA testing services like paternity testing, avuncular, um, health and wellness testing without actually owning or running a lab yourself. So how does a DNA testing business work? So the business model for a DNA testing business is the following. You essentially act as a middleman between clients who need testing and a laboratory that performs the actual tests and genetic analysis. You handle customer acquisition, sample collection, and reporting. The lab does the DNA testing you make money by charging a client more than what the lab charges you. And clients will need these DNA tests for legal reasons, so like child support, um, custody cases, immigration cases, inheritance disputes, or you know just for personal reasons like um, peace of mind, or um, they wanna know more about their ancestry. It could be for health reasons, so like fitness, nutrition, um, genetic diseases, or it could be um, in regard to investigative reasons or um, forensic reasons, so like crime scenes or private investigations, or it could be for pets, so like pet DNA testing, so breed identification, um, behavioral traits or health reasons. So let's talk about the process. Here's the workflow for a typical DNA testing business. Someone contacts you via your website or your phone number. You provide information about test pricing, requirements, and what to expect. They schedule an appointment. You meet the client and do a DNA collection. After you do the DNA collection, you package the samples and you ship them to the lab. The lab runs DNA analysis on the samples. Results are typically ready in two to three business days for standard tests, but tests like non-invasive prenatal or non-standard uh, sample tests, it can run anywhere from several business days up to 10 business days. It varies. So the lab sends you the official results and then you deliver those results to the client either via email, physical mail, or the client goes to your office to pick them up. In short, you're not running an actual lab. You're running the service, client relations, and logistics side. Basically, you're running the front end, everything that makes testing accessible, trustworthy, and convenient for your customer. And the lab is basically just your back end partner. So think about Uber, for example. Uber does not own any vehicles. Uber connects the passenger with the driver. So you're essentially Uber. <laughs>